Pennsylvania man has been arrested in the fatal stabbing of a nurse in his apartment after a dispute over the price of a refrigerator she was buying for her boyfriend. The incident occurred on Monday the 5th of April, when 54-year-old mother of two, Denise Williams of Hornerstown, vanished after she drove to a 26-year-old Joshua Gorgon's apartment, located along Old Scalp Avenue in Guystown. She went there after work to purchase a fridge which was meant to be a gift for her boyfriend. They met and communicated on Facebook Marketplace to arrange the sale. When her family tried contacting her, but she didn't answer the phone, they became concerned and filed a missing persons report that evening, and the authorities went out looking for her. They were able to locate Williams by tracking her phone, and by receiving crucial information from a Facebook account that was provided by her family. At around 9pm, investigators tracked Williams' phone to an unspecified area 8 miles away. They also located an SUV parked four blocks from Gorgon's home. Investigators say they were moved after she was murdered in an attempt to thwart the investigation of her whereabouts. The detectives found fresh blood on the driver's side door and a small bag of cocaine in the center console. There was also an ATM withdrawal receipt for $160 from a Johnstown's bank account from earlier that afternoon. Armed with the knowledge that Williams had planned to meet up with Gorgon, the authorities descended onto the old Scalp Avenue apartment where Williams' body was discovered on the bathroom floor the following day. Under questioning, Gorgon told the authorities that a physical altercation followed after an argument over the price of the fridge got out of hand. The police said he confessed to stabbing Williams multiple times in the chest with a kitchen knife and then dumping her vehicle. The drug seized from her SUV belonged to him. Williams' death has been ruled a violent homicide. During a preliminary autopsy, it was determined that she died from extensive bleeding from multiple stab wounds. There was evidence she fought hard to protect herself from the attack, as she suffered defense wounds on her hands, palms and forearms. Several knives were removed from the scene as evidence. Gorgon was arrested on Tuesday and is held in custody at the Cambria County Prison. He's charged with homicide and two counts of aggravated assault and he's been held without bond. His first court date is scheduled for the 14th of April. A former NFL player killed five people before killing himself in a horrifying event that unfolded in Rock Hill, South Carolina. The mass shooting occurred on Wednesday at around 4.45pm in the home of Dr. Robert Leslie and former San Francisco footballer Philip Adams forced his way into the home wearing a hoodie and camouflage pants. He then shot and killed five people, including the doctor and his wife. The authorities responded to reports of gunshots fired and descended onto the doctor's home and searched for the suspect for hours before finding him at his parents' house nearby. When police arrived just after midnight, he fatally shot himself. The five victims include the 70-year-old doctor and his 69-year-old wife, their two grandchildren, aged five and nine, as well as a 38-year-old boiler technician who was killed while working outside their home. A sixth person was hospitalized with serious gunshot wounds. York County Sheriff Kevin Tolson said, there's nothing right now that makes any sense to any of us. The Dr. Robert Leslie was a pillar of this community, he said. He had founded a healthcare centre nearby. Dr. Leslie has treated Adam's parents in the past, who live locally. A motive for the attack is still unknown, as the investigation into the matter continues.